I'm Pastor George Borkart, and this is another Higher Things Video Short. Take a breath, election watchers, and breathe a little bit. That's the subject of today's Higher Things Video Short. Like, subscribe, ring the bell, get the app, donate. If you love what we're doing in Higher Things, pass it on the faith of the next generation, like our videos, subscribe to our YouTube channel, ring the bell for notifications, get the app. It's available on all major platforms. And donate. Your tax-deductible gift keeps higher things. A youth organization all about passing the faith on to the next generation. Our kids need this gospel in these dark times. Give today. It's been quite a week, don't you think? A little bit crazy. Unresolved. Got some issues. I know I do. Maybe you were angry. Things didn't go your way. Maybe you're appalled. Can't believe the conduct of some of the people involved. Maybe you're just stunned. Of all places, America should have a system of governance and elections that is uniform. Take a breath for a little bit. In the midst of all of this, amongst the anger and the sort of depression, that righteous indignation that you're cheated, that horror that the other side has that much support, whether or not you love Sleepy Joe or think the big orange man is bad, either way, take a breath. Remember your Redeemer. Remember the one who died for you and rose for you. Remember the King of kings and the Lord of lords. You see, this nothing happens apart from Christ. Nothing. No evil goes unpunished. No thing is done in the middle of night and not known about. Christ sees all. He's described in Revelation as the lamb sitting on the throne with seven eyes. He sees all. He knows all. And he judges. You have a father in heaven who gave up his son for you. The lamb sits on the throne is still Lord of all, King of kings and Lord of lords. And this means that no matter what happens in this world, no matter whether nations rise or fall, whether there's wars or rumors of wars, where the things are getting better or things are getting worse. There's God, and he's going to save you. And so the way you treat others in this time is hugely important. I know that we're very partisan, and I know that we're, we've, we've got our battle camps, and there's a temptation to watch and be angry and say, I'm going to remember what you said and how you said it, and I'm going to cancel you kill you, silence you. And I know the tempers are, avail are high on all sides, but now's the time to stop and pray. Now's the time to forgive those who've sinned against you and have mercy on those who deserve no mercy because you do not have a God who doesn't care about you. You do not have a God who doesn't save. You do not have a God who didn't Calvary and Easter for you. He did. And his Salvation, one on the cross for you, will carry you through anything that happens in your nation, in your state, and in your world. And if you believe that something has gone wrong, he will fix it. And if you believe that something has been cheated, he will judge on the last day. Nothing escapes him. But now, pray. Pray for our leaders. Pray for the candidates. Pray for the people involved. Pray for the voters who are counting, the, the, the people who are counting, pray for, pray for our country and be slow to speak, quick to listen, and in all things, merciful to those around you. Because you are not called to anger. You were called to forgive and to have mercy and to love. This is all going to work itself out. And if it works itself out in an evil way, God will tend to it. And if it works itself out in the right way, whichever side you think it is, then God will deal with it accordingly as well. And we'll talk about maybe the judgment that we've gotten from God some other time. But today it's enough to sort of breathe. Just take a breath. Pray the Lord's prayer. Slow down and trust the God in heaven who saves. He's going to tend to everything. And he's going to tend to everything for you in Jesus. I'm Pastor George Borkhart, and this is another Higher Things video short.